Right is now on the line for our first event this evening for the 3XY Supercross International Meeting. This is race number one in our program, C Grade Division 1, over six laps of the Olympic Park course. The rider is on the 3XY starting line and standing by for a start. It's going to be six fast and furious laps as they do that around the course. And the rider being pulled back from the starting line. The machines in readiness and down goes the gate for the first event this evening and charging off into turn number one. So all the riders as they disappear down the Swan Insurance back straight and head off towards the top of the course for the first time. Full field of riders doing battle in this tough and treacherous Olympic Park course. Sorting themselves out now as they come down towards the stutter bumps. And the rider in the lead at this stage, or was in the lead, should I say, and that was number 15, M. Douglas on the Yamaha from Victoria, but he's already relinquished that lead to another of the riders, and the crowd roars as the riders get in all sorts of bother as they come over the whoops and down towards the front of the course. Number 14, our leader at this stage, on the Honda quads, riders coming down left, right and centre, and it's Graham Penhall on the YZ250J in the lead. He's number 14, being followed by number 15 in second place, M. Douglas on the Yamaha from Victoria, and further back in third place we have number 6, and that's Steve Bremner on the Suzuki. So we've got Yamaha first and second, Suzuki in third place, and already those first three positions starting to open up over the rest of the field. Our leader, number 14, Graham Penhall from Ballarat in Victoria. Meanwhile, plenty of action still back on the right in front of our main group. That's going to be an area that we watched with great concern this evening. Treacherous part of the course. You see the rider in trouble there on the Yamaha number five. Yeah. Back to win his second lap now. Our leader, number 14, Graham Pendle. Challenged now by number 15, Douglas, as he sneaks up on the inside. The Yamaha side by side as they head down towards turn number one. Ken Hall on bike number 14, still being followed by number 15, Douglas, and in third place, the Suzuki rider on number six, and that's D. Bremner. For those of you that are coming to Supercross for the first time, you might be interested to know that there are different colour backings on the number plates of these machines. The leading machine at the moment has a green background on the number plate, which indicates that it's a 250cc capacity bike. And the bikes currently in second and third placings are bikes with black backgrounds, and that indicates that they are 125cc capacity bikes. Leading riders coming across the Yamaha River, winding themselves up now for the Honda Quads and the main stage here at the Olympic Park. And now picking up in second place is number six from Bill 125, Suzuki, the water cooled Suzuki. That particular rider is being D. Bremner. More action on the Honda Quad. The rider who's fallen there is the rider who was holding down our second place, and that's number 15, M. Douglas. This evening, race one for C grade division one over six laps. Graham Campbell, our leader on the YZ 250J. I was about to mention a rider who has done it the hard way in motocross, come up through the ranks in mini cycle racing. He's progressed through the junior ranks with the riders between 14 and 16 years of age. And has now gone into the big ranks on the 250 Yamaha, making his first appearance at the Supercross for this evening. He's still being pounded by that 125 Suzuki in second place being ridden by number six Bremner. So Penhall and Bremner, first and second, Yamaha leading Suzuki. And a very long gap back to our third place man at this stage who looks to be possibly number 12 on the Yamaha. And that's Stephen Schwartz. C grade riders as nominated by the Auto Cycle Union of Victoria. The lowest rung of the three steps in the ladder for motocross riders in this country. The riders are starting to get a hang now of the Honda quads as they take two at a time and then line themselves up to the tabletop at the end of the main straight. Here comes our leader once again as the blue flag comes out, indicating to him he has one lap to go. Still Graham Penhall in the lead. Bike number 14 being followed by number six, the Suzuki 125cc ridden by Dee Brennan. 
mentioning C grade being the bottom of the three runs, B grade is the next, A grade being the top, and we're going to see plenty of A grade action as the night progresses. Riders have to ride a certain number of meetings during the year, and points are awarded to them for their various performances at different meetings. And they'll be upgraded according to their performance right throughout the state of Victoria. Half a lap to go in half rally. The Grand Temple on the wise of Yamaha in first place. Who's being chased by that one, two, five Suzuki in second place being ridden by Bremen, bike number six. Lining himself up now as he comes along towards the chequered flag. Out comes the chequered flag and a very fine win for the first event this evening to number 14, Graham Penhall. Second place will go to number six, and that's Steve Bremner on the 125 Suzuki, and the minor posi uh, position is Steve Bremner. Well, a good start, Neil, to our activity here tonight, race number one, the C grade, division one, over six laps. And uh, now that those of you who have seen it for the first time, how will you think uh, when we get the, the A graders on later on in the program? A, a few more C grade events to come out, stars of tomorrow. These fellows are the, uh, the top boys, the, the fellows who are certainly going to be A graders of tomorrow. A great uh, win there to number 14, uh, G Pennell on the Yamaha machine from Victoria. A good win indeed. Uh, Bad luck, of course, for number 15, Douglas, who was uh, in second place there for quite a while. And as the, uh, the stragglers come in, we can't really uh, go crook at them too much for being stragglers because what a hard course for uh, not only the A and B grade riders, but these fellows, the C grade stars, who are seeing uh, uh, their first part of uh, Olympic Park Supercross.